Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I want to tell you about Cal State Los Angeles. Cal State Los Angeles is accepting international students with a 3-point GPA. Cal State Los Angeles is a very reputable university here in the USA. I live in California and I can tell you that Cal State is a place to be. And another thing about Cal State Los Angeles is that you don't need English proficiency if you've studied in English. So it's completely out. You don't need ACT, SAT, all of those requirements that are put on you when you want to apply. You don't need that. All you need is a three point GPA and certain requirements that we are going to go through in this video. If you've not subscribed to my channel, what are you waiting for? Please subscribe. I make videos about studying the USA programs, everything. I also make videos about making money online. So why not subscribe so that you can get updated anytime I upload a new video. So this is Cal State Los Angeles. Like I said before, it's one of the most renowned universities in the US. So you want to try applying as soon as possible. The first thing is that the application period is open. Application starts October 1st to March 31st. If you want to start in the fall, that is in August. This is the opportunity for you to start your application process so that you're going to finish as soon as as possible. Now it says that California State University no longer requires ACT or SAT examinations for admission el eligibility. So they do not require you to have ACT or SAT. So this is a great thing that has been lifted for those of you who've been thinking about this. Now let's talk about cost preparation. Your secondary school education is what you need. If you finished high school and you've done well and you know that with your high school results or academic achievement, you can apply for bachelors, then you can apply. So this is what will go for foreign high school graduates. Let's talk about the grade point GPA. For those who are Californians or US citizens studying in California or have studied in the US, they need a 2.50 GPA. But for, for those of you who are out of the US, you need at least a three point GPA on a scale of four in academic courses of the last three years of high school secondary education. So you must have graduated with a three point GPA in order for you to apply. So the next thing is high school completion. This is just saying that you must have completed your high school before you apply, or you must be completing it totally before school will start in August. That's just what they are saying here. So let's talk about English proficiency. If at least three years of your high school coursework was not taken at a school where English is the only language of instruction, you have to satisfy, you will have to satisfy the English language proficiency requirement. That means if you've studied in a purely English school, all your years of studying, you do not need English proficiency. That is a great thing for those of you who do not want to go through the stress of doing the English proficiency. It's a difficult exam to write. We know that. And sometimes it's difficult to get that 6.5 that most universities are requiring. But this university has taken that off. They say if you're studying in English, then there is no need for you to have TOEFL. And I know that most of us back in Nigeria, Ghana, most of you have studied in English, so you don't need to prove English proficiency, which is a very, very good thing. Now let's look at the application process. The first step is to explore and choose a major to declare on your application. So you have to choose what you want to study. The second thing is applied at Cal State Apply. So you click this link and start your application process. Now, the next step will be to submit official transcript. Let's start here. It says international students not attending U.S. schools will be required to submit official academic transcripts or records. So you have to submit your transcript to show that you have studied. So if you're offered admission into Cal State Los Angeles, this is what you have to do. If you are in if you are an international student, then you have to refer here, go here, you know, to get all the information you will need. Now, let's look at some options when it comes to scholarship. 
So it says all eligible applicants to the honors college will be considered for these and other scholarships. No separate application is required for new students entering Cal State Los Angeles. So that means you must have had really good grades when you were studying at high school for you to have the scholarship. When you submit the general scholarship application, you will be considered for all scholarships university-wide for which you are eligible. Scholarships will be awarded based on comprehensive review of application material. So make sure that you put in every information that you need to put in order for you to get this scholarship. This is another scholarship called the President's Scholarship. Annual scholarships of 2,500 to 6,800 may be awarded to incoming honors college freshmen demonstrating high achievement, motivation, and commitment to education. So these are scholarships that are available for you to apply. So the first step for you will be apply to this university. I'm going to put the link in the description box below. Go there now, apply. Put your documents together, start filling your application form and make sure that you have your transcript ready so that you can be considered. The deadline for the deadline for application is March 31st. So guys, use the link in the description box below to start your application process. Maybe this might just be your next university. This is a great university in Los Angeles, California, and they are accepting international students as well. So guys, if you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up and why not subscribe to my channel to get updated anytime I upload a new video. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.